for the culture, this is more than just a phase Feeling like tsunami, see my wall slip, what a waste It's your boy Tsunami Timo. Tsunami Timo. What's poppin' Tsunami Gang? It's your boy Tsunami Timo, and I'm back at it again. But today, I'm gonna tell you guys which combs are the top combs that you can use on your 360 waves. And the comb that no one will tell you about. Stay tuned. We all know that I dropped the video on combing your waves and what the best combs are. Now, it's been a couple years, and I've tested thousands of combs. So, we all know the two structure comb. But I found out that these teeth right here actually break off quite consistently on the two structure comb. A lot of other ones as well. But this variant of that comb, I actually got this at Target and I find it to be a lot more smooth and uh, durable than the two structure comb. There's no name to this, but Target sells this. So, if you want to get it, make sure you hit up Target. Another comb that's great. It's a wooden comb, any wooden comb, to be honest. But this is literally used for beards because you can pull your hair out of your beard quite easily. So if you use a wooden comb, it doesn't have to be this one specifically. But if you do, make sure that you get you one because these are amazing for spreading oil throughout your hair and they will not pluck your hair out of your head. A lot of people always come to me with, let's say, fine tooth combs and they're like, oh, I think I'm going bald. Well, yeah, that's why. If your hair is very long, you shouldn't be using a fine tooth comb. What you use when your hair is long is one of these, okay? I've showed one of these before. This is just a regular wide tooth comb, okay? This will not pull your hair out. But you can only use this when your hair is really long. So let's move on to the next one. Now, they had this a long, long time ago on Brush King, okay? I've had a few of these as well. I got about four or five of these right now. They used to call this the Torino Pro or the Brush King Fork Killer. But these teeth on this comb right here break off super easy. So if you don't have a lot of money, I mean you can get three of these for probably $3.99. So I mean it's well worth it. You would not think how much benefit you can get from using this comb until you use it. It will not lift up your hair and you can actually just grade right through your hair. It's a fantastic comb and I highly recommend you get this, okay? This is actually made by Crest and you can find this on Amazon. I will leave the link down below. So, the carbon comb. A lot of people say the carbon comb is great for reducing frizz, which it is, but the carbon comb pales in comparison to the final two combs I'm about to show you. So, I've seen a lot of reviews, but I have not seen a review on these combs yet. I don't know why that is, but I will tell you exactly what you need to know about these two combs. Now, these are Cricut combs. One of the top comb manufacturers in the world. They make some of the best combs worldwide. So basically, what this is, is a silk infused comb, which makes it easy for it to glide through your hair without getting stuck. You will not get hiccups while you're combing, you will not get stopped. You will not damage your scalp and you will not damage your hair. I purchased these from Sally's. So one of these is a, they're both rat tail combs. One of these is finer than the other one. I think they're both great combs and I highly recommend you check them out because we all know carbon combs, which I have a few of, are great for reducing frizz. And these are as well. So make sure you go check them out. Uh, I highly recommend you do. Because we all know, summertime, or when it's humid outside, we suffer from tons of frizz. Well, these combs help prevent frizz. Once again, it's your boy, Tsunami Timo, and I'm out. Scare. 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 Whoa. Whoa.